Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Moyes Plays Let's Play of Animal Crossing New Leaf. And there's so much cherry blossom around the island right now. We are of course coming to the end of the season, I believe. So that probably explains why there's more than usual. Uh, but it looks really nice. I love the cherry blossom trees. Um, today we have the fishing tourney. Um, it's the April fishing tourney. There's much more fishing tourneys, I believe, in this game than other games. But the cool thing about today's fishing tourney is... Hello, Chip is that it's any fish that you catch, which means it's not a set fish. So last time it was like horse mackerel, which is super hard to catch, but we can just submit any fish. And also we should probably go and buy some more outfits from the Able Sisters ready for Gracie's next fashion check. I think we only need to do two more until she moves into town, which is really exciting. So I think we should probably go ahead and catch some fish. Maybe we should talk to Chip first, actually. Uh, just get the ball rolling. Good evening. It's nearly evening. Actually, the tournament's nearly over, I've just realized. Um, so we better get a move on. For this month's fishing tourney, any kind of fish will do. Whatever ca uh, whoever catches the biggest fish will be declared the winner. Do you want to hear more? Nah, I'm okay. We get the gist of it. Oh, really? You can bring me any fish that needs measuring up until 6 p.m. Um, so keep them coming. Well, good luck. Try and catch a nice, big, juicy one. We'll do our best, although I still don't know how I feel about Chip eating them in front of us. <laughs> okay, let's... Oh, there's a fossil there. But we've got no time for catching fossils. Let's head straight down to the sea. I feel like that is where the biggest fish are going to be. Of course, we'll probably just catch a mountain of horse mackerel fish now. Uh, seems that's usually what we can't find. Uh, where are all the fish shadows? If it was later in the evening, we literally could have gone to Tour Timers Island or the Island Resort and catch uh, or look for some sharks. But I don't think they start spawning until after six. Uh, so it wasn't very well planned by me. <laughs> And where are all the fish? Here we go. Here's one. It's probably going to be a sea bass. Always a sea bass. Come on, fishy. Wow. Ooh, I nearly missed the button. <laughs> Somehow. I knew it would be a sea bass. I caught a sea bass. What? You again? Okay, we need to remember this. 38.85. In fact, I'm going to write that down. 38. Uh, 38.85. There we go. Oh, there's another fish there. But I don't think this is going to be bigger. Uh, actually, we need a tiny fish to submit just so we can find out who's holding the current record. Um, this late in the day or in the tourney, usually it's already a really large fish holding the record. Uh, so a horse, a horse mackerel. Holy mackerel, only 13.90. Okay, so that's a tiny fish. We, okay, let's go and find out what the record is first. Um, it's probably Wolf Link. Wolf Link seems to always do super well in these tourneys. Uh, loving the loving the cherry blossom season. All the leaves and petals everywhere. Oh, it's my fisher friend. Catch something for me yet? By the by, Nyak Nyak. Once I've measured it, you won't get it back. You okay with that? Uh, sure. Check this tiny little horse mackerel out. Oh, horse mackerel. Uh, right, let's have a look here. Mm -hmm. Looks to be 13.9 inches. Whoa, that puts you in third place. That's not too bad. We'd still be up for a trophy. Uh, keep at that and strive for at least first place record. By the way, the best edge so far. It's a horse mackerel, really? Oh, wow. Horse mackerel caught by Jay with a size of 17.5 inches. 17.5 uh, inches. Okay, that's super easy to beat. Um, so I'm just going to scoff. Oh, no. This is the bit where Chip eats it all up. Bye, horse mackerel. But anyway, go get fishing. Okay, that's a, that's a reasonable record to be so let's head back down i don't think it's even worth um fishing in the river because i feel like the the big fish just unless you can come across some real rare fish in the river they're not going to be very big so you may as well stick to sea fishing for a minute uh, we haven't got long actually we've only got like 15 minutes i think to participate 
Oh, I missed it. No. <laughs> no. Okay, next one. Okay, here's a little one. Although we want the big fish, really. Where's the, where's the big sharks at? Okay. Oh. Oh, it's getting it away. No. This isn't going very well. Okay. Oh, another fish. Okay, at least they're spawning back in pretty quickly this side of the island. Come on. What's it gonna be? It's gonna be a... Oh, a red snapper! I caught a red snapper. I just... Oh, wait. 38.75. Ooh, so we've got a 38.75. Okay, so that's... Let's put these in order. So we've got... Get rid of these clothes that we're not using. There we go. So we've got 37... 38.75 uh, and a 38... 38.75 uh, 38 and 38.85. Okay, this is where it gets tricky remembering all the things. Uh, and you have to do them in order because the moment you beat the record, then obviously it's much harder to get more items. And we want as many items as possible. I think we're still missing a couple of items from the fishing toy series. I uh, caught a horse mackerel. Oh, 13.5. Uh, 45. Wait, what's our first one? No, that was smaller than our first one. We can throw that back straight away. In fact, we saved that horse mackerel's life because Chip would have ate it anyway. Oops. I must not run. We have to walk slowly. Here we go. We also have to allow ourselves enough time to submit all the fish at the end. Oh no, I got too impatient. I'm seriously the worst fisher when it comes to fishing in Animal Crossing. There we go. Ooh, a quick one. So it's going to be another, of course it's a horse mackerel. That's all we seem to find when we don't need them. Ooh, 16.5. Okay, so 16.55. So that will, that might put us in second place. But it won't uh, put us up to third just yet. Uh, up to first, sorry. Um, what time is it? Must be close. Ooh, 14 minutes. Okay, so maybe we should have catch another, another couple of fish. Then maybe we should head up to the river just out of curiosity to see if we can find... Look at that big fish. See if we can find a river fish. Ooh, I was concentrating. <laughs> Another sea bass. Um, whoa, 42.15 inches. Okay. Since when did Animal Crossing get so complicated? <laughs> or, and competitive at the same time as well. Jotting down fish sizes? Whatever next. I, I kind of miss this part from... Uh, New Horizons. Obviously, it's more about how many fish you can catch rather than how big they are. I feel like they, they could have done that, actually. They could have done, like, opposite seasons. Oh, what's this? A zebra turkey fish. Yeah. Thir oh, that's a baby one. 13. We can just throw that one away, pretty much. You're lucky, zebra turkey fish. Release. Yeah, they could have alternated it. So, like, one season it was how many fish you catch. The next season could have been um, the size of the fish. And then the next season could have gone back to how many fish you catch or something. I feel like that would have been a good good way to kind of mix up the tawnies a little bit. Wow. Watch this be a boot. <laughs> nope. A horse mackerel. I caught a horse mackerel. 17. Ooh, it's getting bigger. 17.7. Okay, we've got quite a lot of fish, actually. So we should probably go ahead and donate these so we don't run out of time. But also have a quick check on... Whoops. At the river, just to see. Um, any river fish... In hindsight, we probably shouldn't have put our house in front of the river. We didn't think that one through for the fishing tourneys. Uh, 
and I have a habit of scaring the fish away, so I'm trying to go super slow. Actually, maybe we'll get a better view from this side of the river. Okay, I think the fish know there's a fishing tourney, or all the other villagers have caught them already. Because they don't seem to be spawning in. For some reason. Where are all the fish? Okay, that is weird. Okay, we'll have another... Oh, there's one. There we go. What fits is going to be? A carp. I caught a carp. I really seized the DM. Yes. Oh, I didn't read how much, how much, how big it was. No. <laughs> I was too busy looking at the text. Okay, maybe we should. Oh, wow. We probably shouldn't donate that one because I didn't read. So let's just start with these ones. Okay, a horse mackerel, right? Let's have a look here. Hmm, looks to be 16.5 inches. Ooh, that puts you in third place. Oh, still third place. Keep it up and strive for that first place record. By the way, the best entry so far is a horse mackerel caught by Jay with a size of 17.45 inches. The thing is, if we come first every time, we get the gold trophy. We've already got two gold trophies, so it wouldn't be the worst thing to come in second, because then we could get a different trophy at least. And this horse mackerel is delicious! But anyway, go get fishing. Oh, we, don't need, we don't need to go get fishing, because guess what? We've got a bunch of fish here. Here we go. Check this out. Um... I just realized, you need to go, you must have to go first place to get an item. Hmm, looks to be 17.7 .7 inches. New record! In your oh wow, you're in first place, so that straight away puts us in first place, that's pretty good. So horse mackerel. Uh, man, those guys are tasty with a capital, mmm. I'm so gonna scarf this one down, totally raw of course. This horse mackerel is delicious. Oh, right. I'll give you a dab table. Oh, wait. We already have a dab table. But that's okay. We'll take it. Okay. The, we've got a dilemma here now. Do we carry on trying to break the record or do we jump up straight away to the next big fish? We've got a gap of like 15 inches. But we are running out of time um, for the tourney because it does end at 6 whether you're finished or not. So maybe we should just jump straight up to the red snapper. Okay, a red snapper, right? Let's have a look here. Mm, looks to be 38.75 inches. It's a new record. That's a big record. Uh, it's a good place to be, don't you think? Man, this is a pretty big for a red snapper. Yum, yum. You know, you really can't go wrong with red snapper. Oh, hey, try throwing them in a casserole. I mean, I'm just going to eat this raw, but it's something to think about when you're making dinner. Yum. That poor red snapper. Some of my favourite fish in the game, they are. But... Oh, that's right! Let me give you a crab clock. Wait, have we already got the crab clock? I think we do. Keep it up. Are we not... Do we not need the wallpaper still? Or did we get that? Okay, check this one out, Chip. We've got two more. That should break the record. So two sea bass. Of all the fish, it's the sea bass. Okay, sea bass, right? Let's have a look here. Hmm, looks to be 38.85. Oh no, did we give the wrong one? I think we gave the wrong one. It's a new record! Now you're first in place. That's a good place to be, don't you think? Oh wait, it isn't, the other, it isn't the wrong one. The next one is 42, should be. And hey, they're pretty good even if you don't do anything to them. Yum. Uh, eyes and everything. <laughs> this sea bass is delicious! Wait, what's this? Keep it up. Oh, wait, I didn't see what it was. What was this item that we just won? A lunch tray! Oh, it's a fisher friend. Catch something for me yet? By the by, nyak nyak, once it's measured, you won't get it back. Sure. Wait, we're getting used to it, I think. So here's the sea bass. 
Okay, a sea bass, right? Let's have a look here. 42.15 inches. It's a new record. We knew that. We've got mad organization skills. I must say, when it comes down to it, uh, sea bass are delicious, no matter how you prepare them. And hey, they're pretty good, even if you don't do anything to them. Yum. Well, Chip, we're, I'm glad to be making your day. Please give us another crab clock. Are you serious right now? Maybe we've got all the items. Uh, keep it up. Keep on smashing those records. Okay, how long have we got left? Six minutes. Maybe we can catch one more fish. I don't think we're going to beat 42 inches, though. Uh, and the trouble actually with catching river fish is because we haven't caught many river fish, we might end up catching one that we don't want to give to Chip. <laughs> Another carp. Oh no, 22. We're not going to catch big fish. Abort. Let's go to the sea. I don't think there's many big river fish anyway. Okay, we might have time just to get one or two fish. Where are they? Hmm. Oh, there's one. Oh, a big shadow. So this is probably a sea bass, I reckon. Ooh, quick to bite as well. There we go. We guessed it. Sea bass. I caught a sea bass. What? You again? 34. Oh, that's no good. Maybe we should have carried on fishing for a little longer. What's it going to be? I caught a sea bass. What, you again? 34.9 inches, so it's getting bigger, but we really are up there with the 42-inch um, sea bass that we caught a minute ago. I don't think we're going to beat that today. Um, but that's okay. We've got a bunch of prizes, and I'm pretty sure if we're getting that many duplicates now, I'm pretty sure we've got the full set, it must mean. Although I thought we needed the wallpaper, but maybe we don't. We also need to... Oh, a squid! I caught a squid. Yes, I did! 14 inches as a baby squid. Um, we need to make our basement bigger as well, because we've run out of space in the basement for all of our fishing tawny prizes. Uh, oh, this could be a competitor. A quarter dab, huh? Just kidding, it's an olive flounder. Oh, no, 31.5. That is big, but too... It's not big enough, really. Um, here we go. We've got one, one more fish, maybe. Horse mackerel? No, another dab or flounder, maybe. Oh, twenty point four inches. That was a dab. We'll have to go to the island at some point and do a bunch of fishing to get sharks and then save them for the next um, any fish tawny. In hindsight, we should have done that today because next time it's going to be a specific fish next month. Ooh, what's this? I caught a butterfly fish. Asmaya, welcome to my pocket. 7.15 inches. I wonder what my encyclopedia says about my new catch. Okay, we're going to have to keep this fish. Uh, oh, we've got lots of fish we need to get rid of, actually. Let's throw some fish away. Uh, we definitely don't need these. You lucky, lucky fish. You may go home. Um, we could have submitted them, but we wouldn't have won prizes anyway, so. And hopefully the carp survive in the sea. Uh, maybe they'll swim back round to the river. <laughs> uh, come on, where's the big fish shadows at? We're running out of time. In fact, I think we've only got a couple of minutes left. Two minutes. Well, 
All I see is the small shadows. If anyone has any ideas, by the way, what to do with the beach, please let me know. Um, I don't know if I'm missing something or if there's something else we can do to them. So far, we've just planted a bunch of trees and there's not much going on down here. Another squid. Unless it's a giant squid, it's not going to be big enough. 12 inches. Boo. Uh, nearly released the butterfly fish then. That would have been... That would have been bad. Tiny fish. Look at the size of it. Oh, here we go. Could this be a final last minute winner? Uh, no, we scared it away. Where did it go? Are you serious right now? Oh no, we'll never know. <laughs> this concludes the fishing tourney. Best wishes to all fishes. Okay, let's go check out, see if we're still in first place. Oh, I love the cherry blossom. I've just realized it doesn't spawn on the beach. What? Very strange. Oh, hey, Inkwell. Mayor Bro, this Moriland resident has a suggestion. For the next time project, oh, let's fund a blue bench. Oh, a blue bench would be so smoking hot. Give it, uh, give us some thought, Mayor. Seriously, Splat. Okay, blue bench. Where could we put a blue bench? We need some more benches, to be fair. Okay. Uh, I guess we should probably go ahead and see who's yeah. won. It's time for the award ceremony. Can you go inside the tent and wait, please? Once it's past 9pm, that's it. You've missed your chance. Keep that in mind, okay? Okay, we'll go ahead and do that now, I think. The award ceremony will begin pretty soon here. Oh, Jay came second. We bumped him down. Uh, okay, I'll be announcing the winners one at a time. In third place, with an incredible 16.6 inch horse mackerel, it's Inkwell. Well done, Inkwell. Uh, for the third place uh, finish, oh, bronze trophy Inkwell gets. That's awesome. Well done, Inkwell. Chip, hey, chin up there. Maybe next time you'll do even better. In second place, the magnificent 17.45 horse mackerel, it's Jay. Well done, Jay. For your second place finish, I give you the silver fish trophy. I love the way they're holding them. Look, very proud of themselves. Hey, you were so, uh, you were so close, yet so far. And in first place with a rather nice 42.1 inch sea bass, Mori. Yay, go us. For the amazing first place finish, I am quite happy to present you the gold fish trophy. Yay. I just knew you'd end up winning. Yes, yes, congratulations everyone. Let's hear it for our champion fishes and the yummy fish. Well done. Even though it's just a way for Chip to eat food. <laughs> Looks like the end of the ceremony. I'm looking forward to seeing all of you fishing up a storm real soon. Oh, well, there you go. Another, another fishing tourney over with. It's my ultimate dream that one day everyone will be in the tourney. Yep, just fishing up a storm all day long. Maybe it'll even come true. Maybe. Maybe. You never know. I wish we could get tents like this and just pitch them around town. It'd be so cool. Okay, that's it. Ceremony over. So, the only other thing to do, really, today is to go and double check the Able Sisters clothes and make sure because we need to well we need we haven't got any iconic or ornate <laughs> clothes yet and we need a bunch of rock and roll stuff and, and just a few bits and pieces so let's go and have a look uh, hey Kit Kat wait you didn't move away did you hey Mori I'm pumped about shopping today oh okay I hope you still live here Hello, welcome to the Handmade Fashion Palace of the one and only Able Sisters. Okay, let's get straight to the point. Oh, I like that flower t-shirt next to this one. The official vibe. Okay, so we've got official top, so we don't need that one. Never mind. I might buy this flower one anyway, because I really like that. Is that like a tulip? Cute vibe of the tulip tea. 
Okay, we don't need a cute top, but I'm going to buy it anyway because I quite like the tulip. Um, we've got iconic vibe. Oh, iconic. Um, oh, we need it. Iconic tea. I'll take it. So finally, that's our first iconic item. Um, oh my, shopping for a present. Well, right here we have a leopard skirt. Don't you like the rock and roll? Uh, so we don't need any rock and roll things. Or only accessories from the rock and roll we need. Um, more, sh what are these, shorts? Oh, I missed what they said. Wasn't paying attention. Iconic! <gasps> we need those as well. So we've got top and pants. Okay, so that was a successful trip. Um, so we better check the accessories while we're here. We basically want one of every single one, basically. So we'll just have a look at a couple of accessories. The alpinist hat's a pretty good choice. This is a unisex item, so regardless of gender, if you want to dress up as an alpinist, I highly recommend wearing this accessory. It costs 320 bells. What would you like to do? Try it on. I actually really like that. Oh, iconic! Yes, we'll definitely buy that. So, Ibonic hat. Ibonic? I iconic hat. So, we don't need any more hats then. Uh, wait, we've already got that accessory. We're wearing that accessory. Is that the same color? So, we'll just check the glasses. Uh, a round glass is a pretty good choice. This is a unisex item. Uh, cost for that particular item 240 bells. What are your thoughts about it? I'd like to try it on, please. Oh, they're actually really cute. Oh, wow, the historical. Um, no, nope, we don't need historical accessories. Um, I don't think... Oh, we've got a jester item already, actually, so I don't know. We haven't got the mask, though, so... If you want to dress up as a jester, I highly recommend this. Oh, I, I missed what she said. Oh, wow, that flashy look is very nice on you. Oh, we already have flashy accessories, so we don't need that. So basically, we did get three iconic items. That's super, that's super helpful, actually. So now we just need some ornate things, really. Um, I guess we should probably just donate this fish before we call it a day. Sometimes I forget how long it, like how much time it takes fishing in the fishing toys. Uh, I welcome you to Moriland. Oh, Blathers is awake as well. Hmm. How may I be of service? We've got a small donation to make, please. Would you like to? Uh, what would you like to donate? A butterfly fish. Uh, oh, a butterfly fish. Is it the butterfly fish reminds me of a time? Why does Blathers skip past the text so quick sometimes? I swear it always happens when we're talking to Blathers. Ah, I beg your pardon. I was about to go on a on a tangent here. Anywho, I promise we'll keep good uh, take good care of it. We'll display it later with a detailed description, so please come back and see it any time you like. Thank you very much. May I offer any further assistance? No. Uh, please enjoy the rest of your visit. Well, yeah, I think that's a good place to wrap it up. We've had a pretty busy fishing tourney and managed to come first, so we should get our gold trophy tomorrow. And we bought a pretty much a full iconic outfit, um, which is really helpful. Um, just in case Gracie visits, we're going to need as many clothes as possible. We've nearly got full outfits of everything now, so we should be pretty prepared. Uh, and, of course, we donated one of the fish we caught in the fishing tourney uh, to the museum. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed this episode. Thank you hugely to the channel members for allowing this to happen, allow me to make these videos. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. Bye.